Welcome to Global Omasi Tutorial. My name is Silas Omale and in this training I'm going to walk you through the introduction of Pixel Lab. So what exactly is Pixel Lab? Pixel Lab is an application on a uh, mobile phone that you can use to design all kinds of flower like the flower you are seeing right now on your screen is designed by Pixel Lab and many other uh, that you can do with uh, Pixel Lab. So in this video I'm going to show you around everything you need to know about Pixel Lab application and how you can make use of it so go and download pixel lab right now from your google play store okay so when you already have it on your phone so uh look for it where you have downloaded it pixel lab so so open your pixel lab now at the first start of your pixel lab, you may be saying something like this but my inter my interface will be different from yours because i'm using a pixel lab pro okay so but is function the same way the arrangement is is the same just the background and little features that is not on the free version so if you also like to get the pro version of pixel app, you can comment below and say i need the pro version of pixel app and i'll send it to you now at this particular place is going to be your project and what it means is that everything you'll be designing and you'll be you'll be saving will all will be in this my project so if i open my project i click on my project you see all flyers that have been designing in this place and you see you can do the same thing that you can you are seeing here a lot all of these things are designed by uh, pixel lab okay all of these flyers you can see are designed by pixel lab so there are a lot a lot you can do with pixel lab so that is that you can see all your designs where at my project so for example you are done here you can just click on back and you go back all right so that is that let me go back to now for example this is our interface okay so the next thing i'll show you is the next thing i'll show you now is this particular bar here okay so what exactly is this? so the next one here is a a means that you are at the section of what text okay so this is a particular place you can click on test to type in something you want to write and any of the tests you want to bring so at this session you have a lot you can edit you can delete your test you can copy test bring your test to front or back you can position it increase the test size so this is a session you can do all these things okay so you can give it the test color and everything everything at this section so everything about test and editing you can find it at this area so the next thing we'll be looking is that middle which is going to be a point where you can import something add stickers draw something bring in shape okay and other functions in there so for example if you are going to bring in images this is a place you're also going to click so that's that so for example let's try and import something and see for example let's import a picture okay something like a picture Okay, so for example, let me import this. Okay, um, for example, let me import this. Okay, so for example, this is what I want to import. I've imported this. Okay, so anything concerning the design of what I've import will be activated. Like I can delete it, reselect, copy. Okay, I can even crop it again, send it to back or front. Okay, for example, if I send it to back, you now see that the test is now at the front. Okay, so if you want this test to as well also uh be highlighted you go to test if you want to work with anything test go to this a and send it to back send it to front you understand okay you can copy it and delete it okay send to back send to front okay something like that so let's delete it and uh, work with what we are doing okay so that is that i'll go back to this middle one and delete it what i just brought so a lot a lot you can bring in shape by what clicking this area here which is shape okay I'm bringing your shape so this is a shape I'm, I'm bringing is on white color so i can change the color here okay scroll you see a color so and a lot a lot so that is that i'm bringing on shape so these are a lot of folks uh, okay these are just a few things you need to know for now so at this side this fourth one is what background where you can bring in background change your background color for example let's change this background color you know where i click the first one which is color all right so let's click on color i'll change my background color to green 
so this is on green already so you can change it to transparent that is no background at all it should be transparent so you can set your image size if you don't want this size you want and that's it so when you click on image size already we believe you should know the numbering of your size okay so if you don't know that you can use the custom one okay you can use square profile pictures youtube banner facebook cover art and the rest twitter art so and for example if you pick any of these things you now see that the size is now changed to green so let's return it back to profile picture or custom or square okay so i've done that so uh that is that you can as well use image as your background so remember what i told you this last point here is all about background so i can bring in image from the pixel lab okay so all these things that i'm currently may not be in your own because it, this is pro so other images can be there but this is all these fine fine pictures is in as it's in, if it's in pro version so if you have not subscribed to this channel consider subscribing to this channel at this point so that you won't miss other tutorials like this and this channel is dedicated to how you can make money with social media platforms how you can make money online how you can make money from online business and the rest how you can make money from digital skills this is what we'll be teaching you on this channel and a lot so in fact this particular piece of training graphic design training it will be holding every week okay new set of graphic design classes is always available every week so i would like to advise you to join us in this week in my private class so consider doing that to be a good one but don't forget to subscribe and like this video and the next thing i'll show you here is image from the gallery okay that is the next one image from the gallery you can use it to do your background so for example let me use this image let me pick one here and click on check mark here so this is now my background all right so you can use image as image from the gallery as background you can also snap it from your camera all right so that is that so the next thing here is is this last point here that look like a brush okay you can rotate a lot you can rotate your uh, image you brought okay can you see it at the first point okay so a lot a lot of functions here that you can use okay so that is that so let's go back to let's go up here okay the plus sign there what does it mean the plus sign if you click it you can bring in text bring in these uh seekers chips bring in something from color it means that adding something to your page all right so that is that so the next thing up there is what it looks like a memory sign is a place you can save your work this top one it's a place you can save your work or save the image so if you have done something you can save your work as project when you save it as project it means that your work has been saved to your pixel lab you can revisit it and edit re-edit and all those stuff adjust but if you save as image it will be saved into your phone as pictures like you can print it out and print your design all these things but if you don't save as a project you may not be able to revisit it after your design so save it as project before you save it as image that's that so the other signs there is used for what the other sign up there is used for sharing like you have finished designing you want to share you can share do through this place you can share to what facebook twitter you understand whatsapp instagram and the rest and also save it to your gallery same place here okay so the next thing we'll be considering is um this place is is for what this other one is for quotes there are quotes that follow the application especially this pro and you can make use of it okay so if you click it now you see a lot of quotes all right you can make use of it so the next thing here is what the next thing here is these three options here is that is a place you can click on options in pixel lab and see a lot of things in there all right so that is that so what next will i show you when you, if you are designing and you do a mistake you can use this one to do redo you can use this one to zoom your work you can use this one to set your alignment very well and you can use this one to check the things you have brought in your design so more of this will be training in the class this weekend consider joining us this weekend by subscribing to this channel and if you like to join our training you can comment below you want to join our training and i'll get back to you so if you are done commenting let me know thank you for commenting thank you for liking this uh, video please subscribe so that you won't miss most of our updates later then another thing you need to do is check the description button i'll put a link there that you can join us in class thank you so much see you in the class for more details in Pixel Lab Designing. Thank you.